This screencast will provide you with information on how to conduct a keyword search, and it is for the seventh grade history research project. So a keyword search typically involves using Google, and you place your keyword search terms in the bar, and then Google, a search engine, finds you potential sources that match or include that keyword or phrase of keywords. So I'm going to give you some helpful hints for finding more sources, expanding your search. Hint number one, start with the term itself. In my case, I'm going to use the Chinese Exclusion Act, an act you are all familiar with from our content this year. Number two, Use the term plus the date, Chinese Exclusion Act, 1882. Number three, use the term plus a location, Chinese Exclusion Act and California, Chinese Exclusion Act and Angel Island. Number four, use the term plus United States history, so Chinese Exclusion Act and United States history. Number five, use the term plus four kids, for teens, for middle school. That will bring you, dif bring you to different sources or bring up different sources that might be better for your reading level. Number six, use the term plus any related terms. So Chinese Exclusion Act and Labor Surplus, Chinese Exclusion Act and Immigration, Chinese Exclusion Act and Immigration Law. Number seven, use the term plus any eras or periods. So Chinese Exclusion Act and Industrial Revolution, Chinese Exclusion Act and Second Wave of Immigration, etc. Now, this is the document that you're going to be using and you're gonna be filling this in. I'm gonna show you a model of this in a moment. But when you bring it up, it's gonna ask you to put the topic here and then it says use the grid below to list to make, develop a list of keywords for searching online for sources. List words that will help you fully explore the topic. So I'm gonna list 10 words here for you and give you an example using the Chinese Exclusion Act. You will put your topic in here and do the same thing. And our focus is the heart of the story. We're starting with the topic itself or the heart of the story. So I wanna look up what the Chinese Exclusion Act is, who was involved, when it happened, where it impacted people, etc. So here's our document. So again, I would type Chinese Exclusion Act in the topic. And then I just want to add my keywords. And you're doing this here so then you can copy paste these into Google eventually. But I want to start just with the term. Great. Next, I want to do a location. So I'm going to copy the word Chinese Exclusion Act. Actually, copy it and California. Chinese Exclusion Act and United States history. Chinese Exclusion Act and, or in this case, for kids. I could also do for teens. I could also do for middle school. Chinese Exclusion Act, and any related terms like and labor surplus or and immigration laws or just immigration. I could do Chinese Exclusion Act and industrial revolution or I could put in second 
wave of immigration. Or I could put in progressive era. Chinese Exclusion Act. And in this case, let's try one that involves another era. So, and progressive era. I could do another location. Chinese Exclusion Act and Angel Island. I could do another one. Chinese Exclusion Act and Industrial Revolution. And for my final one, Chinese Exclusion Act, and I'll go for kids because I eliminated that up here. Now I have 10 of these total. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy these, Command C, and then I would go to a Google search. I would actually place it in here and see what comes up. So that is how you create your keyword search list. Thank you.